Hi guys, I'm going to review Doctor Who Season 12 Episode 8. I love that it was a whole episode this time. It was really fun. And there's some spoiler things that I'll talk about like, I guess, two minutes in the video. So yeah. So where should I start? Hmm. Well, they basically go to this haunted house, like, and I guess they meet a fa famous person. The, b the time period's 1816. And they're like telling like horror stories to each other. <laughs> and then that's when they when they open the door, like they think they hear a noise. But you know it's the doctor and the crew. <laughs> and yeah, like you know, a bit on like when creepy stuff start to happen. Like, you know the moments when you're watching Scooby Doo and then when they go in the door like the, they end up on the other side, like other side of the hole. <laughs> yeah. That kind of thing was like going on. Cause there was like some weird energy thing happening. And like we see this mysterious figure outside as well. And then there's this other character, you know, who the doctor meets. He's going for some weird stuff as well. Like he's like walking floors and stuff. Yeah. And then there's like the main guy, why the reason why this mysterious figure is, you know, in that area and all this weird stuff's happening. Cause because it's after something that this guy has who who they find later. And yeah, like in 30 seconds I'll tell you that, but yeah, <laughs> definitely a fun episode, it's like probably a good episode for like Halloween times, so yeah, it's one of those great Halloween episodes for Doctor Who, <laughs> even though it's not, it didn't come out in Halloween, <laughs> yeah, I definitely have to watch this one again, it's been a while since I can say like, yes, I definitely want to watch this again, and I'd probably watch it at Halloween, maybe sooner and then again on Halloween, so like three times this year. <laughs> But yes, spoilers now. So yeah, it's just like a part of Jack's message comes true. You know, we get to see the long Cyberman who's that mysterious figure outside. Which, oh yeah, that mysterious figure kind of reminds me <laughs> of like a Courage of the Cowardly Dog episode. Yeah, because man, that, sh that show <laughs> scarier than any horror movie. It freaks me out as a kid. But yeah, there's like a scene where, you know, you see outside shining and it just reminds me of you know, one of those monsters who you see outside. Ooh. <laughs> and you probably know which one if you've seen the show. Even though that's not my most scariest one, it's like definitely one of the most scariest moments of the show. <laughs> but yeah, that's with you, that's the long Cyberman, he just like teleports inside. It's like, and it's not like a normal Cyberman as well, it's like has like half human face and then, you know, half Cyber face. And it's mission is to find that person who I was talking about, who has that. Basically has the thing that it's after, and my always is happening. And then, it was kind of cool to see a Cyberman. It was definitely different. Hmm, I wonder if the Doctor was a bit afraid of it. <laughs> yeah, sure, he's dressed on standing in the door. <laughs> like, going in his face and all that. A bit risky, but yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it basically... Kind of gets its way at the end, really. <laughs> I like how it says, I am inevitable. <laughs> like Thanos. Wow, it you know gets its victory. But it was the only option the doctor had. He had to give it what he wanted, you know. So he didn't kill a, a very important famous person for history, which could you know could have changed the future and everything. And who knows in a negative way. Yeah, so I don't know how that's gonna go now, because they might have kind of saved the day, but the Cyberman basically got his goal completed in this episode. The long Cyberman. And we'll, we'll just see what happens from there. <laughs> Next episode seems like we're gonna... I think it's jumping into the future, I can't tell, because it looks like it's in the past somewhere. You know, a bit more of the, yeah. More than 1816. <laughs> yeah, we'll see how that goes. And what they do with this long cyber man. I really liked what they did with it in this episode, but yeah, we'll just see how that goes. And how much it gets to, you know, keep, you know, achieving its goal. I don't think it's going to work out in the next episode. Yeah, this probably might find a way to stop it, but then... I don't know, like... Because I don't know if they could build it to something for the finale. And I really hope they bring back Jack Harness in the finale. But I don't know if they will. And they have to answer what they're doing with that doctor. That mysterious doctor. Because I've heard reports saying that they're going to change the doctor, maybe to her? Well, they said it's going to be a black woman, but we basically already have one right now, but we don't even know what we're doing with her. But yeah, 
that's my review for episode 8. It was a great episode. Uh, I'd love to watch it again. Alright, so later one I'll be streaming Resident Evil 4. And then, you know, do the second to last video for San Andreas. That'll be a stream. To get out of the Lost Ventures. And then, I don't know, some other day, I'll, it'll be the last stream where I'm back in Los Santos. And then, you know, I'm just finishing the last missions. So, yeah. See you guys later. Peace.